Hello everyone, welcome to Jasper Mazzy. How are you all doing today? In today's video, we're going to be cooking lemon pepper wings. Cool. Yeah, that sounds good. Are you going to cook them? No, you're going to cook them. Oh, no. You do all of the cooking. <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to be making lemon pepper wings. Um, And let's see how they turn out because, to be honest, I've never made them before. Hopefully they're good. So stay tuned to see how they taste and how they smell and how we take the order. Okay, you can go now. Okay, guys, so we're here. We're going to make a special meal. The big size baby because, well, because we're going to experiment. That's why. So, yeah, we're going to make those and let's see how it turns out because I've never made them. Have you ever made them? I've never made them. Yeah, so we've never made them, so we're curious on how well we're going to do. Don't shoot us if we get it wrong. All right, so the very first step we're going to be doing is um, boiling the chicken. We have to boil the chicken so the meat can soften. That's why when you take a bite out of it, it's a little more tender. What we're going to season it with is lemon pepper seasoning. We're going to add a little bit more of salt. And after these ingredients, we're also going to put them... Um, uh, well, we're going to try to mix them with butter, with salted butter. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you'll see the, the steps as we go along. Alrighty, so as we said, we're going to boil the chicken. But before we dip them in there, um, we want to kind of slice the chicken so that it can um, cook from the inside. You can either cook it, I mean, you can either slice it or uh, stab it. I'm kind of doing both so that it can um, get the best of both, you know? Yeah, kind of just get it all around. Oh, I almost fell off. Right. See how I'm cu I'm cutting it from the inside, you guys. That one didn't go all the way. There you go. Now remember, guys, we're not experts in cooking, so we might not need to do a lot of steps, or we might need to take more steps, but the point of it is that we're trying, right? Right. So, there's plenty of them. There you go. So make sure you guys get all the chicken because you're cooking um all the chicken right so yeah so then after you're done with that then you turn it on to a uh, I guess to a high heat so don't forget guys you boil it to an hour and an hour and a half but it's very important for you to check it if the chicken is tender then that means it's well and it's cooked but if the chicken is still hard then it's not cooked right yet so always make sure you cook your chicken right. And we'll be right back with the next step. Okay guys, so we're here with the next step. The next step is to cover the chicken with butter and salt and pepper and a little bit of more seasoned salt. The reason why is because that way when you fry them, they can really get the juice from the butter and the lemon pepper. All right, so you kind of just want to rub it all around the chicken and kind of get into the cuts of the that we made earlier. Just make sure you cover it. You know what, guys? I'm making more of a mess, so I think this will be better. You can actually just do this. That way, you know for sure it's getting all around. All right, so this one's done. Okay, guys, so here you have it. You have your king-size chicken nuggets. Oh, no, wait. Chicken... Uh, <laughs> chicken legs <laughs> so what do you think do you think they're tasty i'm kind of nervous because i don't know how they're gonna taste i'm excited you i are? love chicken so much and especially the lemon pepper wings at wingstop let's dig in and see how they taste all right so you ready ready to taste it let's do this yeah you can definitely taste the lemon pepper 
but I think it needs more butter. I think it's tasty. Do you think it's missing something? Yeah, it's missing a side, like fries. <laughs> <laughs> or veggie sticks. Yeah, but other than that, you think they taste like Wingstop or not? No. <laughs> no. Not as good as Wingstop. Aw, oh, darn it. Um, and besides, I prefer the wings over the legs. So, what do you rate it over? I rate it good solid eight. Oh, wow. Okay. All right, so I'm going to rate it a good solid eight as well because the taste of the chicken is kind of different. It's not the normal taste. I don't know. It's missing something to compare it to Wingstop. It's missing more like a tender, juicy taste, but I think it has a pretty good, juicy taste. Mm -hmm. Well, that's good. Yeah, I don't know. I, I got to really see and taste um, Wingstop again to like try to match the flavor. <laughs> so I don't know. But yeah, so I'm, I'm going to be proud of myself. Well, no, I'm going to be proud of ourselves because um, uh, we cooked it well. Yeah, I did most of the cooking this time. <laughs> yeah, she did play a big role, guys, behind the <laughs> scenes. So we finished talking. I, I can't wait any longer to dig in. Okay, let's dig in. <laughs> so we'll be right back with the outro. There you are, Tom. Oh. Finally, you come out. Yeah, you missed the whole chicken wings. <laughs> Alrighty, guys, so there you have it. That's how you make chicken wings with lemon pepper. Um... So, what is your opinion about this? I thought they were really juicy and tender. Um, there was some fat on it, so I still think Wingstop's wings are better. I think overall I did good. Um, maybe I was thinking, I was actually thinking when we were done filming uh, that maybe there were some things I could have done better. But, um, I don't know, I think for my first time I did good. What do you think you could have done better? Okay, so at first I boiled them to, to cook them. I boiled them uh, for like an hour and a half. No, for, a, yeah, for an hour and a half. Um, and I could have, instead of just boiling it with water, I could have put um, maybe some more seasonings to the water to maybe grasp the, ju the juice of it or the flavor. Yeah, grasp the flavor of the, you know, of those seasonings. And I think that would have been better. Um, but I don't know, or maybe I could have actually, you know, breaded them with a uh, flour or something. That's for next time, right? So what do you think we, I could have done better? Or what do you, what are your thoughts about the flavor? I don't know. I thought the flavor was pretty good. I guess you got to be a chef to understand what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah. But, um, if you guys are a chef and especially if you work at Wingstop, please let us know how to make them. That way we can make them this channel. Yeah. Send us the video. Yeah, send us the ingredients, most of all. So we hope you enjoyed our video. Give us a thumbs up. Punch that thumbs up right in the knuckles. Make sure you light a light on it or whatever. And um, don't forget to comment. Good luck, everybody. And remember, stay happy and be positive. Oh, and make sure you cook a lot of foods. We're going to make slushies. We need a blender because we're going to blend the hell out of the eggs. So you ready to taste the rainbow? Stay frozen, baby. <laughs>